Okay, hello, novice and ten and unders. So today we have quite an ab workout. Um, the first thing that we're gonna do is we're gonna do a little warm up. So let's just do some arm circles forward. One arm first. Ready? Here we go. Just gonna do a couple big arm circles forward. Just loosen up. Good. Same arm. Go backwards. Just try to stand up nice and straight. You can rotate back and forth like me as if you're swinging backstroke. Okay? Switch arms. We're going to go forward for a couple. And backwards. Swim some backstroke. And good. Okay, now we're going to do our goal post. So start here at 90 degrees. Remember, stand up straight. Your arms are straight to the side. Okay, up, down, down, down. Up, 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 down, down, down. Up, 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 down, down, down. Let's go one more. And down, down, down. All right, awesome. So, oops. We're gonna do a couple of marching in place, okay? So you can put your hands like mine, just about here. We're just gonna bring our knee up to touch our hand, just nice and slow, okay? Just warm up our hips, okay? Very good, almost done. Good job. More, two, and one, good job, okay. So we're gonna do a little bit of stretching. Okay. We're gonna go into our upward dog here. Good job. Make sure you keep your shoulders down. Don't hunch over like this, okay? Try to drop those hips all the way down and then shoulders back and down and then your head is up nice and straight. Okay. Good. Push into our downward dog. Good, just make sure those legs are nice and straight. Okay, now we're gonna do our runner's lunge. So just make sure that you get that foot right here on the outside of your hands, okay? Straighten out your back, straighten out this leg as straight as you can. Now the hand that's closest to your foot, you're gonna go up in the air. And then we're just gonna take three deep breaths right here, okay? Keep that back leg nice and straight. One more breath. Good, bring this hand back down. Stretching down the dog for a second, and then let's bring the other leg up, okay? This back leg is nice and straight. The hand that's closest to the foot is gonna go up in the air. Okay, so we're going up, three deep breaths. One, two, and three, good. Now we're in the perfect position to do our four count mountain climbers. Okay, here we go. One, two, three, one, two, three, two, one, two, three, three, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, five, keep your back down, a six, seven, shoulders over your hands, eight, nine, and 10. Woo, all right, we're nice and warmed up. So today, we're gonna start with something a little new. So, first thing we're gonna do is 10 squats with a side leg lift. So, we're gonna squat and lift our leg up to the side, squat, other leg up to the side. So we're not gonna bend our leg when we lift it. It's not a kick. We're just gonna lift it straight up, okay? I'll show you. Here we go. So, just like this, make sure you stick your booties out. Keep your back nice and straight. Drop your booty down to the ground. And keep these knees behind your toes. We don't wanna go over like this, remember? So we just stick our butt back, straight back, and we just sink that booty down. 
Okay? Make sure your heels are touching the ground. Here we go. And that's one. See the leg lift? Two. Three. Four. Five. Nice and straight. See? Six. Knees need to point straight forward. Seven. Eight. Nine. One more. And ten. Good job. Next, whew, that we're gonna do is 30 seconds of butt kickers. Okay, so we just run in place, keep our knees pointing down, and we bring our heels up and hit our booty with our heels. Okay, so it's gonna be about 30 seconds. Okay, ready, set, go. Good job, get those heels up to your booties. Keep your knees pointing down. Stay on the balls of your feet. Don't land like this. Land like this, nice and light. Okay? Five, four, three, two, and one. Woo! Nice, go. nice job. Okay, the last part of this little set, we're gonna do a 30 second plank, but when we're in our plank, we're gonna just lift a leg, Put it back down. Lift the other leg, put it back down. Lift the other leg, put it back down. Okay, so we're gonna keep doing that. We're gonna be in a high plank, so up on our hands, not on our forearms, up on your hands, okay? So 30 seconds. Here we go. So remember, we want our shoulders to be over our wrists, okay? You wanna stretch those legs out, up on your toes, back's nice and straight, hips are down. We don't wanna be up like this, and we don't wanna be down like this. Okay, just like this. And we'll start the clock at 30. And we're just gonna lift your leg. You don't need to lift it way up here, all big like that. <laughs> okay, stay nice and flat. And just lift it up. And we lift it up and we squeeze that butt cheek. Back down. Squeeze. Down. Squeeze. Down. Squeeze. Down. Keep those shoulders right over your wrist. Keep your back nice and flat. Squeeze, about 10 more seconds. Good job, five, four, three, two, and one. Okay, so that was your first exercise, or your first set of exercises. So you're gonna go through that three times. Okay, so we went through it one time. You're gonna go through it two more. Okay, so you, you can take a breather in between. That's totally fine. Okay, but just remember through all of this, anytime we do a plank, anytime we do anything else, we want to stabilize our core. We want to keep it tight and we want to suck that belly button in. And we always want to stand up nice and straight. Okay, so just as a reminder, the 10 squats with your side leg lift. Okay, remember we're not kicking. We just lift that leg to the side, squat, Lift that leg to the side. Okay, 10 of those. And then the 30 second run, the butt kickers. So make sure those heels are coming up, the knees are staying straight down. And then the 30 second plank, lifting your leg up, other leg, other leg. Okay, go through all of that three times. Okay, the next thing. Okay, I so said at the beginning, this is gonna be a good core workout. So the next thing is actually a Caleb Dressel workout. And Caleb Dressel is like one of the fastest, if not the fastest burner in the world, okay? So what we're gonna do is we're gonna do toe touches. Okay, I'll show you what that is. And then we're gonna do, we're gonna put our legs at 90 degrees and we're gonna try to touch our heels. And then we're gonna do flat leg crunches. And then the last thing is we're gonna do flutter kicks, four count flutter kicks, okay? So here's how it goes. First time through, we're gonna do 15 of each exercise. Second time through, 10 of each. Last time through, five of each, okay? So here we go. The first one is the toe touches. So make sure your back is all the way on the ground, especially your lower back. See how that just happened? Watch. Now my lower back is on the ground, okay? 
Your legs are gonna be straight up in the air. Arms are straight up in the air. And we're just gonna go up, back down. Up, back down. Very small movement, very small. Okay, let's do 15. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, one, two, thirteen, fourteen, and fifteen. Nice work. Okay, so the other one is your legs are going to be at 90 degrees. Now we're going to reach for our heels. Okay, so just like this, you're going to reach, reach. Okay, we're going to go 15 of these two. Ready? Legs at 90 degrees, arms out, and reach. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, and fifteen. Woo! My abs are on fire. Okay, the next one. Oh, yeah. So we're going to lay down on your back. Legs are straight out. Your hands are going to be by your ears. Okay, all we're going to do is a little crunch. Not a sit up, a crunch, okay? So you're just going to come up a little bit just so your shoulder blades get off the ground, okay? Just like this. See how small I moved? I'm not making a big movement, okay? Let's go 15. Here we go. One, two, push your belly button down. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Woo! Nice job. Okay. And then, oh yes, the last thing we're going to do, a part of this, is flutter kicks, but it's going to be four count flutter kicks. So kind of like how we do with our mountain climbers, we're going to do the same exact thing, but with flutter kicking. Okay, so hands under your booties, okay? Legs out nice and straight, heels up, and here we go. One, two, three, one. One, two, three, two. One, two, three, three. One, two, three, four. You want to keep five. Your legs nice and straight. Six, seven, two, three, eight. One, two, three, nine. Make sure you point your toes. 10 and 11. 1, 2, 3, 12. 1, 2, 3, 13. 1, 2, 3, 14. 1, 2, 3, 15. Woo! All right. So with that one, you're going to do 15. They're called repetitions. Okay, so 15 repetitions like we just did. And then you're going to go through all of those exercises again, but only do 10. Okay, 10 repetitions. And then you're gonna go through all again one more time, but only five repetitions, okay? So, after you're all done with that, let's stretch it out a little bit because we really, really worked our core. So, roll over onto your bellies, okay? Hands right under your chest, and we're gonna push our hips down, and we're gonna push up. Let's do our upward dog. Remember, we don't want to be in a turtle shell. So, shoulders down and back. Whew. Stretch it out nice and good. Good job. You can even look up a little bit. Feels awesome. All right, let's push into a downward dog. Good. Try and make your legs as straight as possible. Even if your heels don't touch the ground, it's okay. If you're up here, that's perfectly fine. Okay, because you still should be feeling a pretty good stretch, okay? <sighs> Take a couple deep breaths. Okay, let's roll back into our upward dog. Oh, it feels so good. Make sure you get out of the turtle shell. Good job. Wiggle around. Now get to that plank. Plank, jump our feet forward, and we're going to come up just nice and slow. Make sure you keep your knees bent. Head comes up last, okay? Five, four, three, 
two, and one. Good job, everybody. So if you missed today, that's okay. You have to work out now. If you were with us today, try to get on to this one at least two more times. Okay, and do this workout two more times. So just as a reminder, okay, I'll send it out in the email that I sent to you guys and just give you a breakdown of all the workouts, okay? But just, I'm gonna go over it one more time. So 10 squats with the side leg lift, okay? 10 of those, 30 second butt kickers, and then 30 second plank lifting a leg up one at a time. Okay, you're gonna go through all that three times. And then take a little rest. And then we're gonna do the toe touches where your legs are straight up in the air and you're trying to touch your toes. And then when your legs are at 90 degrees like this and you're trying to touch your heels. And then you're gonna lay your legs. <coughs> wow, excuse me. You're gonna lay your legs flat on the ground and you're just gonna do a little crunch. Remember, we're not doing a sit up. Okay, we're just doing a little, whoop, a little crunch, okay? And then we do the four count flutter kicks. Okay, so the, you're gonna go through that three times, okay? The first time is you do 15 for each exercise. The second time is 10 for each exercise. The third one is five for each exercise, okay? And then we just stretched it out at the end. Okay, so I'll make sure I include that in my email. It was so good to see you all today. And I hope you all have a great week. See you next week.